Right guys, so today we're looking at a set of QSL darts. It's from the launch just today. Um, it is a Chinese Zodiac theme and they have kindly sent me the Tiger um, version. This is soft tip at 20 grams. It does also come in 18 grams soft tip. They do do, do do do, so, uh, steel tip, 21, 23 and 25 grams. So you've got various for steel and soft tip. I will be using point converters on these. Uh, I'm just not in the mood for changing boards. Uh, so I will have uh, steel tip points on these soft tip darts just so I can throw it in the throwing section. But looking at the packaging first, nice beautiful graphic packaging. You can see the tiger graphic on this, just absolutely stunning. On the back here, it's just warning about children and supervising and that and such. But I'm not gonna look at that. So you slide this open and it comes out and it's got the yellow um, packaging insert in this. Um, so the, 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 what I like about QSO is they think about presentation for the packaging as well. So it comes in the yellow packaging, it's got a cover over it, just keep your flight, flights protected in it. And as you can see, it's just the three darts. There's no point sharpener in this because it's soft tip. Uh, normally I'll have the wee sharp point sharpener in this, in the bottom there, but again, this is soft tip. So they don't have this included but you've got your three darts there fully set up as they come so having a closer look at the dart itself right as you can see on that nose area you see the knurled thing that part there that is just your point converter so don't add that it has a round build nose and it's got that lateral cut on the nose section then it goes in that scallop section area where it's got the milling cut on this it looks like a wavy sections as I like to see it. After that, you've got the twin ring with the black paint coating in the middle of it. Then after that, you've got a slight scallop section with the radial grooves and the lateral cuts. Then it goes into a straight section just at the back there with the, again, it's just the same radial grooves with the lateral cuts and it goes down ever so slightly at the back to where the Ross T19 a integrated stem and flight which is a square shape and it's yellow in the clear it's quite nice looking uh, it's a soft uh, plastic polymer these Ross T19s so quite nice and very light so you have got that gold titanium cone right along this barrel and again it's been remachined uh, and it's got that sharpness right along this so for grip levels, the front you tend to hold, the front grippers would tend to hold into that scallop section at the front. So giving you a bit of a push on that. I'm going to give that a, a three and a half. Middle grippers, you, you'll get a bit of both the, the scallops and that. Where that black coating is, you'll hold that section there. So three and a half and rear is three and a half. So 3.5 right along that barrel. Um, it's got a good grip right along that section there. Um, yeah, Def it's stickier, so I'm quite curious to see how they release off my fingers. But nice looking dart, love the gold, little scallop section at the front and then uh, just above the halfway or in the halfway section. So depending on where you hold, you've got that little push point on the two little scallops. Rear grip has got that nice straight section at the back. But it does look really nice. I kind of wish they sent me the steel tip, to be honest. Uh, I would have preferred that in the 23 grams. But looking at it, looks really nice. The Ross T19s, it's a soft polymer. Uh, and yeah, we'll see how they go as well. So on that note, let's have a few throws at the board. So there you have the dart there. And I forgot to mention the size of it. So it's 45 millimeters in length and 7.4 millimeters in width. So it's a short, chunky dart. Um, but I'm hoping be able to throw these really well as you can see where the point converter comes into it so i'm hoping it doesn't put the balance off the darts but i will hope holding the scalp section just in this area here um but front grippers you'll definitely get a grip there middle definitely in that area where it's slightly scallops in and rear just at the back there but i'm hoping i can throw half decent so Let's see how we get on. Just try to get the feel for the darts there. Um, 
because I've got that point converter on it, it kind of messes with my, my grip, but under 20 grams, so <laughs> it's slightly too light for me. Maybe I should have put my board up, uh, the soft tip board. But they feel really comfortable with that grip, the titanium coating and the re-machined, it's gave it that sharpness. Um, but I just wish there was steel tip. Ugh, 45, I'm getting used to them. Just throw on a little bit quicker. Doing a Michael Smith kind of throw. Oh, that's a bit better, eh? Just throw it a little bit quicker than usual. Oh, 66, just hot off that flight. Five. Right, let's do a little summary. Right, so the Q Soul, the Chinese Zodiac Tiger, 20 grams soft tip. Not a bad that, a little bit chunky at that 7.4 millimeters. Um, it just felt a little bit chunky in the hands, but the grip on this and the texture feel was very nice. It's definitely got a 3.5 grip level on this. I think it's just got that, got that titanium coat and then it's been re-machined. Um, which gave it a little bit of a bite to it but a nice short chunky dart 45 millimeters by 7.4 um fits comfortably in the hand again for soft tappers it's a good controllable dart very light at 20 grams obviously you get 18 grams uh, and i think it doesn't matter what you're holding on this barrel you've got a good comfortable dart um, grip and the release is really well as well. It does come with your Ross T19 integrated flight and stem. Um, not a huge fan of them just because they, they kind of dent really easily but I know that they've got the Ross 77 just been released and yep I'll show you now. I am product testing them now see how they are and I'm very impressed with them so I'll keep a out for the review on the Ross 77 coming soon but again the whole that it's very nice I, I do like um, the grip feeling on this and the way it looks I do wish they sent me the steel tip version just to try out I think if it was the 23 I would have been a lot more comfortable in throwing these but good variety of weight out there so you've got 21, 23, 25 and again the soft tip at 18 and 20 so do have a look at these and do check out the other zodiacs that they brought out as well at the same time uh, i will leave a link in the description box to the qsol page so you can click on that and have a browse to your leisure we'd like to thank qsol for sending these out to me to review so thank you qsol for doing so and don't forget there will be a review coming out of the raw 77 i'm just doing a little test on them see the durability uh, then i'll bring out a review on them just shortly so keep an eye out on that one and that's it for me guys hope you liked the video don't forget to click that like button subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already turn notifications on for more reviews and live streams and i'll catch you in the next one happy done guys bye